Hello, lovely people. Welcome to another video. 10.0.7 is live and a very cool item, Ring, has been introduced to the game. The way in which you can farm it and increase its power is by running the Zaskara Vault. In order to run the vaults in the most efficient way possible, you need Zaskara Vault keys. Here's the most efficient way I found. Get a lot of keys fast. Log on to your main character and do the Forbidden Reach questline. If you skip the side quests, the main story should take you roughly around 40 to 45 minutes. After you finish the campaign once, log on to your max level alts and use them as a way to funnel keys to your main character. Conversely, if your main character is super geared, want to change the character that you're playing because maybe your class got buffed or a certain spec got buffed or nerfed and you want to pivot to another spec or to another class, this tip works. The main reason why this tip works is because the Ziskaren vault keys are Blizzard account bound. So you can bounce them around different characters. It doesn't matter what faction you are. All you need to do is be at max level and have the campaign finished on one of the characters. When you first log into the game on the new patch, you'll be presented with the quest Hidden Legacies. Fly to the top of the tower or take the portal from the main room to the seat of the aspects. Talk to the NPC and you'll be given a dialogue to skip all of the quests, instantly teleporting you to the Forbidden Reach. Once on the Forbidden Reach, talk to the NPC and again, choose to skip. Now you'll be teleported to the docks. Just walk up to the green dragon, accept the quest, turn around and go do this one quest. Once on the shore, you have to click a couple of NPCs and then loot six pieces of scrap that are scattered throughout the water. Once you're finished, talk to the NPC Fly back to the camp, talk to the green dragon again, accept the quest, then fly to the entrance, give in the quest, accept the next one, which gives you six keys, turn it in, and voila, you have six keys in your bag that you can mail to your main character and drastically reduce the time in which you can farm keys, especially for that initial run. The only downside to this is the fact that you need to have max level alts this is not really a problem. A lot of people have max level alts. I myself have leveled quite a few characters. It's not that hard to level them. And I'm pretty sure you guys won't care about playing all of them, maybe one, two, or three, which means that you have plenty in order to funnel enough keys to your main character. If you only play one character or you care about farming rares in order to get your keys, jump onto your most geared character and farm on that character. It's gonna speed up the process you're gonna do more damage. And because the keys are not soul bound, you can email them to whichever character you want to get your ring on and run the vaults this patch. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, share it with somebody that you believe might benefit from the wisdom. And if you haven't checked out the season two dungeon guys, click here to watch them. Bye-bye everybody.